You're looking at a live picture now of Petco Park, where the Padres annual Fan Fest wrapped up about an hour ago. We brought you live coverage of the excitement during 10 News this morning. 10 News reporter Marie Cornell shows us how the team and the more than 17,000 fans kicked off the start of baseball season. It's not every day Karen Gersten can play catch with her son on the field at Petco Park. Usually they're in the stands watching from above. So it's pretty neat. It's, it's a lot bigger than it even looks up in the stands. But today, thousands of fans got that rare opportunity during Fan Fest, the day the Padres gives fans a behind the scenes look as people toured the clubhouse and even got to run the very bases the players do. For many fans like Tira Wakayama, this has become a tradition. As a young girl, she watched the Padres. Now she's bringing her three kids, giving them a glimpse at what it's like to be a Padres fan. Yeah, this is awesome. This makes it real. We really feel like, wow, this is what they do. And for players like Josh Johnson, it's a way to interact with the fans. You know, they're passionate about, about the game and they want to come out here and support and they're, they're ready for a winner. So um, hopefully we'll give it to them. And this year, fans got the chance to hear from the Padres PA announcer finalists as they popped up right there on the big screen, and you can hear them over the loudspeakers. And number seven, Chase Headley. 10 News was at Petco Park two weeks ago during the first round of auditions. Now Barrett Cohen is one of about 30 who have made it to the next round. This is the fun part because you see all the fans here. But in the end, it's about giving the team and fans something to be excited about as the season approaches with players heading to spring training next week. From Petco Park, Marie Cornell, 10 News.